what we have here essentially are exotic cars, beautiful women and a bald guy in the middle of it all. Now despite managing to tick all the boxes, this is not a shoot for Fast and the Furious and I'm not the poor man's Vin Diesel. What I am however is in tea. In team because what we have here essentially are a group of more than 50 women who managed to flip the script when it comes to exotic cars. They own supercars and now they're out to own the road. Welcome to Queen's Drive 2023. I see exotic cars, I see beautiful women right. uh, and I see this beautiful paint job that you've done on your car. Tell oh, yes. us about this paint job, tell us about Queen's Drive. Queen's Drive Club is a club which uh, I founded last year, which is basically uh, a group of women who can come out together, who can have fun. It all started with one day when I saw my husband going out on drives with other men. But uh, the thing was that he said, oh we are all men, why do you want to join us? So it just struck me, you know what, I'm going to create my own woman's group, get out on the road and we are going to go for our own drive. So this is the third edition, yeah. tell us what the viewers can expect today, what are we in for, what are you going for today? So viewers can expect women from all over India coming out together, just going out for a drive and having a lot of fun and telling the world that a woman can drive nations, they can drive countries, they can drive uh, uh, different offices and they can drive very hell whatever the hell they want to drive. Perfect, sounds good. In fact, being speaking of being on a roll, let's go for a quick drive, you show me your driving Yes, speed. yes, please. Tell me something uh, that when we talk about women and you talk about women driving, yeah. do you often, are, are you often met with that stereotype that look, Make only like that women can drive. I don't think women can drive. All you the deal time. with that? All the time. How do you respond All to that? All the time. Well, I just say that why don't you come and race with me? <laughs> I'll show you on the road. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when you use the word women power, horse power is not normally associated with it. So just quickly tell us about being a part of this women's uh, driving club and what it means for you. I'm here from Kolkata and just for this drive because I'm super excited to when I heard like something is happening, going to happen for like ladies, only for the women and this is the best thing. Nowadays, this things is actually changing. Now, like women are love to drive their cars, like Ferrari, whatever. I love that attention and maybe sometimes I drive for that only. You very interestingly moments back told me that you've been born and raised in Delhi. Now any woman who's been born and raised in Delhi would not be unfamiliar with the probing eye of the males, of the men that we have here. Does this only magnify that many times over yeah, with more people looking at you? Yes. Because that's a stereotype women in Delhi especially have to deal with. Yeah, it surely does. So how do you deal with that? Do you get more attention? Do you, uh, yes. do you take it in your stride? How does it work with So I ignore men? them. <laughs> I, I really ignore them. Well, every time I mention the word supercar, the very words that come to mind often are testosterone, muscle and sometimes wind diesel. But the petrol head, that, that word is being turned on its very head by this group of 50 women. A group that, it, of course, are seen around the world as well, which slowly are sensitizing popular culture and essentially having a hell lot of fun. HSBC presents CNBC TV 18 Future Female Forward, the Women's Collective.